All right. I got to show you guys this. So I got this plan. You see, I've got two people in the bathroom right here. I've got three people in here, if you don't count the ghost. And then I've got, uh, what, six people in this room right here. So what I want to do is I'm going to trap them in these rooms. So we're going to put the walls up. And we're going to remove the doors. We're going to make it so that they cannot get out. That's the goal. Okay, now this side over here. Take the bathroom door off. And we should be good. We should have, what, 11 people trapped. I thought he was in the bathroom. Okay, so we have 10 people trapped. Right? So watch this. Watch what happens. Here we go. See that? Walked right out of the bathroom. Walks in here. They totally defy the laws of the universe. So now I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight people in this room. I'm telling you, man, you break that shower and it's your ass. God, maybe they are going to stay put now. Yeah, but why would they? Those guys, there was, there was, there were six in there, and now there's eight. So they walked right through the wall. Maybe I do have them trapped. <laughs> so let me try something. I'm gonna put a door into this kitchen. Narrow post and lintel frame. That's what we want right there. Perfect. That's the other thing. Most of these guys are new. You don't have the same ones. Look at that turd head, did he broke my shower and my sink? I'm going to dig you up. I'm going to throw you out. Ooh, okay, wait a minute. I got another one. Hold on. We got two in there. So let's get rid of this door too. Okay, so now we've got... How many people trapped? We've got two there. We've got eight in here. And three over here. Let me put the bathroom door back in. No need to inconvenience those who live here. Come here and mop this floor. Actually, you need to repair, repair. You realize that if you carry this through, you're going to have a major league haunted house. There's going to be so many ghosts. It's already haunted. It's just haunted by living people. <laughs> it's already haunted. This place is a nightmare. Hey, he's going to school. She's heading to school. Good. Don't be late. I'm fixing it. I'm fixing it. I couldn't get the door to go in. And I'm assuming the reason is because there was water on the floor, I guess. Because it kept saying it couldn't intersect other objects. So, hello. Where are you guys? Come on. You gonna go to class? You guys make me so anxious. It says he's at class. Now, what's, watch what they do. This is so stupid. So they ride around the building, and then they go in right there. You are an hour and a half late for class. Where are you? You guys make me so insane. I'm an E. Just, I, I, I'm, I'm stressing, and it's not even me. I wonder what happens when you cheat on exam. Luca is turning his homework confident. Yeah, he could have gotten more out of it by being on time. Claire's responsibility is in range to earn the irresponsible trait. Here. Go give your final presentation. Cadence. Go give your final presentation. Okay, Claire, why don't you head home? Or unless you want to go to the kiosk. Oh, it's closed. Well, I guess you're going to have to go home and... And battle the madding crowds, although now that they're all locked in, there might not be any, right? Claire, just go home. Just go home, sweetie. What are you doing? No, 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 no. Don't you leave that bike there. Remember, we talked about this. You cannot leave your bike sitting. Get on it and go home. I swear you're losing your mind. You're all losing your minds. You've been in school too long. So the goal is, on this semester, to have them wait until Friday and then apply, right? The problem is, if they do that, 
can they stay in this housing? Right? And I suspect the answer is no. Claire's got an exam. I didn't know that. Oh, she's already on her way. Sure she is. Can you please go to class? Now this says she's in class. And the thing about it is, is it true? Is it like the game sees her as in class? So no matter what she's doing out here, she really is in class, even if she's still fiddling around on her bike? Or is the game seeing her as being late for class? Because there's part of it that's like, yeah, she's in class, but then the other part of it's like, yeah, she's late for class. So I don't understand that part. Let's go home and see if everybody's still trapped. They are. Look, we have got a bunch of people trapped. <laughs> You want something to read? <laughs> I love it. My one regret is that we let that one guy get away. So we're not going to be able to uh, register late because we have all this going on. What happened to you? Oh, I had to go to the bathroom and wet my pants on the way to class. Can you do me a favor, sweetie? Can you please mop that up? And I'll see if I can put the door on. Cadence. There's an upstairs bathroom. Can't you guys go to the upstairs bathroom? Say, I don't have to, I don't have to uh, have privacy. This is my fiance. I wouldn't want to pee in front of my fiance. Husband, yes. Fiance, no, you're still, you still got the, the prissy stuff going on. You don't want him to see that you have bodily functions. Come out of there. Go here. All right, here we go. Let me see if I can do this now. Okay, so we have to go into here, and we have to put, we put the abandoned re retail store here, and the household funds here, and we transfer, and then we go back in, and we transfer out. Then we should be able to build this wall. There it goes. Okay, it was the water. How odd is that? All right, we got it. We have two working bathrooms. If any of you guys go in there and you decide you want to stay in there, I will lock that bathroom down tight with you in there. I am tired of you people in my house, so I am going to leave you locked in until you expire. This one's in here mopping. Got plenty to read. Only one chair, though. They're like, hey, anyone, help, help, help. We're trapped in here, help. <laughs> oh, look how nice this is. There's one, oh, that's their, that's their roommate. So do we even have a stray around here that is not locked in one of these rooms? We do not, not a single stray. Look, there's the light. I think that's the one that used to be on this, on this night table. Hmm. Interesting. So, yeah. Everybody that isn't locked in has evidently vamoosed. This is the room you wouldn't want to be in. There's too many people in there. <laughs> I love it. How? Do, how? How do you get A pluses when you're such a, a screw off? So, obviously, oh. She always gets a C. I don't even understand that because she's as good as any of the others. But for some reason, a B plus. That's pretty good when you consider that they were late for class on a regular basis. So evidently coming in behind the building like that isn't a big deal. Because I'm assuming that this business right here is because she didn't finish her schoolwork. Want to do one? Do you realize if you do one class, you will have either three days free or two? What the heck? Let's try one. How do we do it? Oh, no. I can't stay where I am. Maybe I have to do full term in order to stay on campus. Let's try that. Oh, no. My plan is foiled. It's going to kick me out of this housing. Why is it going to kick me out? So it doesn't have anything to do with that. So let's go back. You don't suppose it's because I have that violation, the oven violation. I got an idea. Let me do this. I'm going to sell the stove 
So we should be in compliance. And so can I now sign up for another term? So let's go over to him. He's always first. Enroll. There it is. So it was because I was in violation. So that's what we want to do. We want to stay in our current housing. Okay, now let's do Little Miss Cadence. I have to wait and see what happens. I want to see how bad this really gets with all these people locked in here. So I want you, sweetie, to, we want to study, do your homework. What's your problem, bud? Do your homework and do your homework. And then I need to put another stove back in here. So what if we do this? What if we go like this and we transfer one buck over two and then we go buy us a stove? And since we have a budding chef, let's do this one. I want to splurge. It feels so nice not to have all those people milling around. All right, we're in violation again, but it's going to be okay. Can I have this by any chance? No. You cannot have anything that they put down. We're going to have them dropping like flies. And then, here's the question. Do you put them outside so you have the cemetery out there so this is the most haunted house in the world of Sims? Or do you just delete their headstones? That's the question. How do we want this game to go? And the other part is, do we want to go use this business? Right? And here's the other part. If I wipe all these guys out, are there just going to be new ones come and take their place? Although I have noticed that we don't have anybody coming around. We're, we're, we are empty. There is nobody in this house that does not belong. I guess you guys know it's only a matter of time. I've completely had it with you. Say, hey, can you hear us out there? Hey, help us. These people are crazy in here. They're trying to kill us. We came and we stayed forever and ever and wouldn't leave. And now they're upset and they've got us locked in here and we can't leave. There was a redhead with glasses and he actually walked out of this room. He was in here and then he walked out, I swear. And he escaped, but he's the only one. <laughs> okay, let's have a look at their schedule. I want to see what it says. We have class in 12 hours, and it's on Tuesdays and Thursdays. What about you? Same thing. You have a Tuesday-Thursday class, and hers is at 3. That's kind of yucky. What's the matter? You're a loner, and you hate having people around because I can hear them through the wall. Where are you, anyway? How come you're... I don't know why I even ask, but I've almost got my homework done, and then I'll go home. Yeah, social bunny worthy stuff. We have all these people trapped in our house. Might have wished that I had done two classes instead of only one. But what I'm thinking is we might be able to do something about that business. You're going to have cake? Oh, yeah, I've just been craving some cake. I want some cake. Get on my nerves about the cake. Here, can you do me a favor, sweet pea? Can you come in here, go to the bathroom, go to take a shower, oh, for the love of God. What do you want to bet that it's that ghost that did that? They are hard on the plumbing, they're hard on the appliances. This guy, this new roommate's like, what have I done? It could have been me. I missed it by that much. Or is he thinking, I need to get out of here before they lock me in a room too? All right, it is late. I didn't realize how late it was getting. So I need you to go to bed, sweetie. He's already in bed because he's smarter than everybody else. Sleep. We've got class tomorrow. Do we want to check in on our, our captives? I can't believe that nobody else comes in. So it must be because there's no amenities, right? There's no place for them to hang out. But they used to go in and mess around on the computers and stuff. They didn't care. They'd sit on their beds and everything, but nobody's coming in now. So it makes me wonder if there's some weird thing about this that makes them think that it's a public building. 
But anyway, I'm going to go ahead and call this, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye.